I am happy though that in this game, water is not like instant death or completely foreign to the character. You know, if it's too deep, yeah, you can't really do anything in it. But if it's shallow water, yeah, you can walk in it. There are other games where it's just like, holy crap, there's a puddle. You have to walk around it. You don't know how to swim. I've never understood that in video games. Never understood that logic. But it is prevalent in a lot of games. Just, nope, you can't go that way. There's water. It's like, damn it, I am not. I don't melt in water. I'm not water soluble, you know what I mean? Die. Damn it, I caught him in the middle of the up animation again. It's too late. Did you drop anything? Now, okay, let's go into this cave now. You gonna let me go? She's gonna let me go. So let's go this way. Now that she has quit her bitching for now. I'm sure she'll think of something else. Fucking Gion. Get Die. Get whacked. Oh shit, we got a new enemy. We got a couple new enemies here. Uh, this is a kid goblin. This guy here. And then these guys. These guys are little splitters. <laughs> Oh, come on, I should be able to hit both of them. Uh, these are green drops, as, as you can clearly see there. And I've reached level 7, uh, so that uh, the candy that I used was probably a waste, but it's just candy. Nothing I, nothing I desperately need. God, these green drops. Hit them all. I don't care how many there are. Hit them all. And apparently, it, the... the it's hard to say which animation it is that they're not letting me attack during because there's so many of them that I can't really tell which one is immune. Now let's head up here and we have reached triple digits HP, which is always nice. These screens are huge. I always forget that about this game, that the, I always expect more screens. Um, damn it. Give me that ax, I could use that. Ah, oh, she, she whacked him good. I always forget that in this game, the screens are like ridiculously huge. Damn it, poison needles. I've been poisoned. Now poison... Uh, yeah, I think we've got all the poison. But it does not last very long. But it is scary looking, that's for sure. That's for sure. Damn it. Hit the guy. He is not a better swordsman than you, Jake. We can... Oh, she got him. Yeah, the battling in this game is a little spotty at times. There's no other way to put it. It... It tries to be a good action RPG and it definitely succeeds in some aspects but some of them some of them I'm not a fan of particularly that right there and I should know better by this point <laughs> but I'm stubborn and I refuse to learn apparently okay you need to get hit there we go one more down he goes anything oh. Let's try going the other way first, because this way looks like it'll go forward. Balloon level zero? No! They casted a balloon on Cheon! Oh, come on. You know this animation again. Stop casting balloon! Now she's just like frozen in place. Friggin' balloon. Get, die. You die. And Cheon reaches level seven! So we're getting there. We're, we're getting up in the levels eventually. The problem, though, is that when I try to kill those guys so I can clear the path so that she'll follow with me... Well... Huh. No way further on. Lava in the way. They, they typically respawn, which is annoying, to say the least. You kill an enemy, you think you got it, but no. No, you don't. Let's just move on. Take on more goblins. You guys tried to eat me. I don't think I haven't forgotten that. And I can hear him sleeping. Can you hear that? That's the sleeping sound. And there he is. Oh shit, there's a couple of them. Die. Huh? I bet you're guarding something. You are! There's a skull on the wall. That can only mean one thing. It's a magical switch. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I derped him up with my sword. Just, I hit him upside the face, and he's like, ah, my face. But that has drained the lava down here, which is what we were looking to do. And is there anything else here? No. Like I said, very, very skimpy on the treasure. If this was any other game, that would have cleared up some treasure over there. Oh, shit. 
Get out of there, Shihan. It is not going to work out well for you. Take it on those two guys by yourself. Do I get them both? I did, but this guy refused to die. Hit the mushroom then. Anything else? We got a uh, green drop. Stop splitting. No. Yo, damn mitosis is not nice. Damn your mitosis. There's only one of them, so it's mitosis. Dot. When they're doing their splitting, I can't hit them. That I figured out, but... I should be hitting more than one of them with each attack. There's a shit ton of them. They dodged! They hopped up and they dodged. What kind of crap is that? Hit them again, Gion. Damn it. These guys, they're so trolly. Oh, they freaking did it again. Stop splitting on me. Stop splitting. There's three of them still. What the hell? Fucking green drops. Better be giving me a lot of experience and a lot of money for this. Fucking green drops. Which, their name makes them sound like candy, but they are clearly not candy. If they are, they're the best kind of candy ever. You just need one left over. And then the next day, you'll have a full box yet again. There's still three. There we go. Got a few of them. How are, how are they not dead? Come on. Somebody needs to die. All right, I got one. No, screw it. We... If they, if they spawn another one, you gotta be fucking kidding me. And it, like, regenerates their health. What kind of crap is that? Oh, no, we're done. We, we are done here. You guys can go suck a nugget for all I care. Fucking green drops. Hey, what do you know? A treasure chest. They are being kind to me today. We got a treasure chest. I will cut out any fights with green drops from now on. Those guys can s Oh, they can suck a railroad's bike for all I care. How did I miss him? He was, in, he was in the middle of recovering after getting hit. And it didn't count. And I... And I found the magic rope for that. Very, very nice. Now the magic rope... Well, we can uh, leave a dungeon with that. That's the easiest way to put that. And I got poisoned. These guys poisoned as well. Okay, I'm taking these guys on. They have trolled me way too much for me to let them live. Okay, I finally got them. And Jake leveled up because of it. God. That is how long that fucking took. No, you you can probably live. I'll be nice to you. God. I feel like I'm over-leveling, but I'm just trying to kill things along my path. It just happens to be leveling me up quite a bit. But the magic rope is appreciated. It works just like the magic rope. Well, not necessarily just like the magic rope in Sword of Mana, but it's very similar. You can escape dungeons and that kind of stuff, which is definitely what we need to do from time to time. Hopefully, I don't necessarily need to do it because I'm losing, but, you know, something to keep in mind that you might need to do. Oh, let's just use the fast way out of the dungeon. Fucking green drop. No. I'm just, uh, there's, there's no real point for me to take those on. Just, no. Damn it! There was something there! There was a treasure chest! I wanted to open it! But no, I could not. I can't get up there. So let's just move on. And we have yet another switch that I'm gonna need to press. So, let's smack it upside the face. Look at his face now! Oh! What the hell happened here? Something fell off. Can I not go over these rocks? I'd like to get past the rocks, but they are not letting me. Ugh, there's a green slime down there. He can he can go fuck off. What? The music changed. What is going on here? What? We have dwarves everywhere. Hey, dwarves. You can hear rumblings from somewhere even deeper than here. It sounds like digging. It does. This is the village of dwarves. Thank you. I couldn't have figured that out for myself. All, all Japanese dwarves look alike. They all have Viking helmets. I've never understood that. You're going to... Yes. That's what somebody else said. It's always nice that you guys are consistent with your messages. The underground palace has been buried for ages. Now, I don't believe there is much for me to do here. There's 
infinitely small earthquakes. There, again! But there is a place here where... There doesn't seem to be anything else. I think this actually leads further on now. Yeah, this is not where we wanted to go. We'll take care of that eventually, though. That is the path out. Uh, I, was, I was hoping that was going to be a, a house of some sort. What do we have here? It, it's the, they're not going to tell me, but it looks like a blacksmith of some sort to me. Blacksmith! Show me that sword. It's covered with rust. I'll break in no time. I'm what? The blacksmith. I'll reforge it for a hundred guild gold GP. Do it. I got plenty for now. All right. Wait a sec. What am I holding while he's doing this? It's done! I've never seen a sword as fine as this one in my life! I hope someday I can forge such a splendid sword. My hammer has started to glow! Wait just a minute, that must be the Mana Sword! Astonishing! Perhaps the power of the Mana Sword has seeped into my hammer! Great! I think I'll try and make an axe with this! Come back in a while! Nice! So now we have an upgrade sword! It's all silvery and shiny! Which is always uh, nice. Well, compared to be, being rusty. I probably should save at the end, so I'm going to go ahead and do that.